Okay, so Wally is also playing for OU World Cup now, so why not record that too? While I'm waiting for another OUPL game. Let me just fix dimensions and stuff. Okay, so he seeks Taunt Abu Coco. I don't know why he taunt the Among Us. Because Among Us can't spawn electric terrain anyway. Oh, oh, Wally's team looks kinda clean. Like, it looks aesthetic, aesthetically pleasing, if that's correct English. <laughs> They both have a Mew, so they know Mega Melee Team got released. I have to prepare for that, that's a threat. Let me close Skype and shit, I don't wanna overload my computer, cause I have a slow computer. Guess the Landris and I mean Taunting is a good play in the sense that he can't support the Landris anymore. Cause the Landris is not on the ground. Electric Turin only works on the ground, so technically he could've still put the Landris to bed. I assume this is... Either defoxes or uh, he has three potential defoxes. He can also be defog Mew. Oh yeah, he's defoxes or this Mew can have a Will Whisper Fire Blast. So that like some fire move. The Silver's not staying in here. So we see the Mew Mew on Mew action. As some might say, it's better than Pax on Pax action. And this is well used defogger. I assume if he even has defogger, he could also be. Nah, I think this has to be default Mew. So, I think this is gonna be knockoff Mew. Okay, rocks. Oh, uh, Psychic is also kinda con on defensive Mew at the moment to hit Toxapax. Man, I was just about to eat. My man spammed me that this game was happening, so I had to record it. Yeah, I will check afterwards as per usual. If I don't know which team they are on and everything, I will go to the thread afterwards and let you guys know. But yeah, he has a nice uh, offense here with Mega Metagross. Let me see. I think the Kalyu has to be scarfed on this team. This team looks so weak to Volcarona, even with Scarf Kalyu. Like, Scarf Kalyu can take like 35 from Fire Blast. You can only switch in like w twice. And they can also Giga Drain on the switch breaking that. And like, what else does this team have? Maybe he has some lure on something. I don't know, Bloom could be Sash Rock to him, I guess. But yeah, you have to keep rocks off for that to be able to have the Sash intact. This Mule will probably have like Roost, Stealth Rock. Knockoff and Willow Wisp, maybe. Or Taunt and Willow Wisp, I don't know. Yeah, I was like, like I said. Like, the Coco is not doing any damage really, it's just getting worn down by hazards. Wondering if it's Aya Papa Berry Coco, which is a really cool set to get back a lot of health. It only pops when you loan health though, like, the berry activates when you loan health. Other than Citrus, Citrus activates earlier, but only heals, I think, 25. I don't know how much percent exactly. But yeah, the Greninja comes in on a defog, so that was a nice play. I don't even know who Volius' opponent is. I assume this is the uh, Ash Grand with Dark Pulse. Yup, yup. Scarf Kelio coming in, getting that nice attack boost. Let's go. Physical Kelio, I'm just kidding. So he has a Mungus. He can try to Scald Burn the Mungus or he can double break in the Mungus. Goes in the Mew. I thought Metagross would have been a good play there. But I guess he doesn't have a move to touch the Scissor on Metagross. But Metagross is one of these Pokemon where you can just, even if you don't have a move to hit Scissor, you can just try and fish for boosts. Like, I don't think he could afford to stay in with Amoongus on Metagross and a potential Zen Headbutt. Like, that's just too risky. Amoongus is so nice to have in this game for Breloom, for Keldeo, and for Coco too, kinda. Okay, so he tried the will wisp So, I think he doesn't have Psychic then. Oh, it's Defog Volt Switch. Life move probably Roost, or some other utility. Dang, this game is gonna take a little bit longer. It's like a bit more balance-ish, like this guy's team. A bit more fat, and like, well, his team's not that fat. 
He only has the Mew, like the rest is pretty offensive. Like the Lando might be defensive too, but... Goes Heart Ninja on a Volt Switch, so I don't know if I agree with that play. That's a lot. I mean, still scouting for a potential Psychic, I guess, but that was weird. Like, why not go to your own Mew if you want to scout for that? I mean, you will have a reason why I made that play, but I just don't see it at the moment. I'm kind of tired too. But nah, I just feel like that was a really bad... Not bad, but like weird. I don't know what he was predicting there, basically. So Brilliant gets goes for SD. Um, I think it could be Z-Move Brilliant. Which would be pretty cool. Maybe that could break through the Among Us, but he decides to go Zapdos, which out... Speeds Brilliant. It was the Aya Papa Berry said, like I was hoping. But this Coco basically... It's not getting anywhere, like the, the electric turn just ended, this Coco's not doing any damage to the opponent's team. That was good afford to stay in there because the rain ended. And he can go for Discharge Heatwave, Heatwave probably. I don't know if this would have HPIs, he showed Defog on Scizor, so this could this could be 3 attacks up this with Roost. I see you as a trick here on the Landrus, and the Landrus has shown that it's not Scarf. I think it changed that moves. And Rocks and U-turn. Like, ro Scarf Rocks is not common. Like, that's not a set at the moment. Like, looking at his team, he's probably defensive Lando. And yeah, looking at the moveset too. <laughs> so, again, he with again, or oh, HPIs if he has it. I mean, obviously, HPIs is fine if you have it, because you don't want to risk missing a heat wave. But yeah, it's looking kind of bad for Wally. I don't know if he can break the. Op <laughs> He's kind of struggling with the Among Us. And if there was, if the Scissor wasn't in the background, the Metagross could put in some work. As the Coco gets crit there, which sucks for Wally. But I don't think the Coco was doing much, like I said, with Among Us being around. So now the Metagross finally comes out. Electric to Rain Thunder Punch does pitiful damage. Why did I do nothing? Oh, he gets the para, so yeah. This is what I'm talking about, why Metagross needs to go, like... I mean, I know this is hacks, but... In this scenario, you get the para, okay? But in every other scenario I use Metagross, I always get the attack boost and just run through the... Like, if they have a balanced team, I just run through. Like, people can are saying you can run counters. Metagross has some counter play, I agree, okay, there's a miss. But, like... What is Scizor doing back to this Metagross? Like, tell me someone. Like, it doesn't have- Scizor doesn't run SD, what is it doing back? Like, people are- If there would be good hazard control, you could use different hazard control and you can use SD Scizor again. That would be dope, but... Like, Ruth, Devog, u turn Bullet Punch, you're not doing much to Metagross and they can just fish for boosts. See, that is 22, that is, does nothing to Metagross. Mesh almost is the same as Scissor, which is crazy, but yeah, you can force it out. The carrier can only come in one more time, I think. Maybe two more times. Now, only one more time. Next time it's gonna be oh, as a crit. Oh, well. Well, you mm, kind of getting unlucky here. There's a Coco got crit and a Kelly gets crit now, and... He always has the Among Us to switch in. And he doubles in the Mew, trying to default probably. But yeah, I don't see Wally winning this at all. This game should be over, pretty much a wrap. So, <laughs> okay, the opponent DC. So we're going for the win condition internet now. Just kidding. <laughs> yeah, my man's Colin was actually mad that he was not in the recording for the easy versus tricking game. But I had some like, um, okay, the opponent is back. I got some issues with my recording program when I have other people in the in the recording. Their voice is five million times louder than mine, even though in the settings I put mine louder and put them down. It's still not working. But yeah, let's not talk about that. I will fix that in time. Okay, he said can't click, so that's basically like... It's like a glitch, how do you say it? That's th sometimes on small crews, I've seen that happen before. People just say that they can't join the game they're in. They're in the game, but they can't click anything. So I don't know if they have to recreate or if, like if it works, if he refreshes. Well, I'll pause it, I guess. Okay, I was just eating because there was nothing happening, but I just started again. 
We went for defog and this is a U turn. Wait. I forgot which turn I stopped. Oh, so yeah, Mew went for soft ball on the Mungus. I think that's where I stopped. Mungus goes out into Scissor. Mew defog, Scissor U turns out. And um, Greninja comes in on. Mew came back, go Landris. Yeah, okay, so Greninja gets U turned in on the Mew. Slow U turn. Lando gets sacked off, Gunja gets the Ash form, Gunja switches out, Brutum gets an SD bullet seat, kills the Mew, so we are actually, okay, we are back now. We are live again. I don't know if this is Z Rock Tomb or some wild shit. I think Z, Z fighting move is more likely. If it's Z move. Like, Z move makes the most sense to me. Unless it's... <clears throat> Sash. So he'd have killed the Kelt because the Kelt got crit earlier by the Dark Pulse from Gran. Ice Punch coming on. Um, yeah, okay, Ice Punch. That crit doesn't really matter there. He's just going for the boost. Now, this is. Um, yeah, this is where Metagross is broken. There's the boost, there's the para. Oh, yeah. This is Metagross. Um, Basically beating one of its best checks when we won. <clears throat> 26, there's the para, bop. Nice Metagross counter you got there. I mean, I know I know he got really lucky with the para too. Not only now the boost, earlier the para. But yeah, I don't know why these value games are so hexy. The OEPL game I recorded with Volley was also hexy. <clears throat> yeah, Scarf, Garchomp can revenge the Metagross, so... The Mew is not healthy enough. I assume the Mew is getting sacked here. And then the Breedon can come out. Go for SD predicting these. Predicting the Among Us. <clears throat> yeah, did he go for SD? Nice. Okay, okay. so now I will see the Z. I want to see the Z move or the natural gift or something. Oh, give me give me the lure. There is the Z move. There is the Connell Crush. Okay, that's not going to kill. It kills! What the fuck? Whew. Oh, so the reason that kills is Among Us is more spadev in his meta. As, okay, Zapdos just revenged the Brillum. And yeah, Scarf Jump wins now. Among, Among Us is more spadev in his meta to check Ash Grin. I mean, yeah, okay, that's, <laughs> that's dodge, but it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. Unless he gets a boost, Meteor Mash, and he can Bullet Punch crit the Chomp. I don't even think that would kill. Uh, Garchomp goes for Earthquake and will you opponent takes this game as we are gonna go to OU not OUPL we're gonna go to the um, the forums and check out who his opponent actually was so we are here on Pokemon online the threat for the World Cup and it says European Union onion dude I don't know how I only know how to pronounce this in German my bad was team Germany okay and will you or will I owe you was Aureus so I think it was Ori's an alt, but yeah, I'm not hundred percent sure because he didn't make his post yet. Like he didn't make his GG one win post, GG one post yet. So, but it should be. This is the like, week five. Mm -mm, let me see. Yeah, oh. Yeah, okay, Aureus and Fak is 1GG, so they were posted for them. I will click on a replay again just to ensure that that's the game I recorded, but I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, exactly, that's the game I just recorded. So it was well you with Aureus. So I hope you guys enjoyed Team Germany. Um, are they 4 and 6 or are they 563? Yeah, yeah, I think that they just, they just, yeah, this guy also won, so they have 5 and 6. So they can make it 6-6 six, six potentially. But yeah, I don't know if they can even make playoffs with that, because they lost a few weeks earlier. The last weeks, I mean. But yeah, I haven't been recording much of all you world, um, Pokemon Online World Cup. But yeah, if there's like, playoffs for that, I might record that. 
because I'm not really sure which team is like qualifying at the moment for playoffs. If there's playoffs, like I assume there's gonna be playoffs because like World Cup, right? So why would there not be playoffs? It's a World Cup. Oh, here's official standings. Let us click on this. So we have European thing. Canada's number one. Germany's number six and US East. What? US East is number six? How? Brazil number five. Number five. So we have Greek, France, Canada and Europe doing pretty well here. Oh, that's group A. That's group B with Asia, Pacific, Latin America, China, Spain, Italy. Yeah, okay. So yeah, I might cover some playoffs of that. If you guys are interested in that, let me know and peace out, friends.